What is up, you guys? It is Star Fox Jet checking in with the all new Let's Play of Mario Kart 8 Deluxe with Nintendo Switch. Now, guys, we almost got like what? Uh, let's see, half a five, half a ten is five, five, six, seven. We got seven hours until 2018 is here when 12 o'clock strike. 2017 is officially gone. So, for the last remaining of 2017, I'm going to show you guys another gameplay. I think I'm going to upload, uh, I think I'm going to upload two gameplay today. I don't know which one it is, but one of them is this one. And I think I might show you guys another gameplay. I don't know, I'm going to put up a toll to see what gameplay you guys really want me to see. What really, I might put up a toll on YouTube later on today to see what kind of poll you really want me to see. Really, game you want to be played. For the last remaining hours of 2017. But for this one, I'm going to do another gameplay on uh, Mario Sport. So, the last time we was here, we went to single player and we went to versus mode with Princess Daisy, which she was still awesome and amazing. So, this time we're going to play online with people on this one. So, let's see how things are going well on this one. Okay, so last time we did, we did with Princess Daisy. So, this time we're going to do it with Princess Peach. Yes, and I know Princess Peach is excited and everything. Yada yada yada. Crap like that. <clears throat> Alright, so now we're searching searching for players this time. The last time I, I tried you know what, honestly, before I did this, I woke up early in the morning and I tried to see if I could like get the uh uh get the video started and I wanted to do it with FaceTime, you know, because I didn't show you guys anything good for Christmas. I, I really did want to show you guys something special for Christmas, but, you know, I was hanging with the fam, and, you know, it was a holiday time, so I couldn't show nothing for Christmas that time. So I wanted to show you guys something for the New Year's, and something good, and something very exciting. I'll get you guys all rare up, uh, you know, and raw up, I mean, raw up, I said rare up. Um, you know, well, there's something to get you guys lifted for 2017, because I know you guys are going to be having a party, and you guys are going to be having a fun time, and I know you guys had a good, oh, hold on. Oh, crap. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on, I'm so sorry. All right. Um, like I said, uh, that was a mistake, I don't know what happened there. Um, so yeah, like I said, uh, I know you guys had a good ho I hope you guys had a, a enjoy your holidays and stuff like that, oh. Okay, I'm getting ready to I'm getting ready to uh to watch a race. So, hang on, people. I'll be right back. I don't I don't I don't want to talk to you guys while I'm watching the race. Okay, so I'm back. So yeah, like I said, I didn't want to talk to you guys over the uh over the uh spectating mode because I didn't want to do that. But uh yeah, like I said, at the end of 2017 is here. I want to show you guys something special. I did want to show you guys something special for Christmas, but you know the fam was hanging out, so I was hanging out with the fam. Christmas. By the way, I hope you guys, by the way, Merry Christmas to you guys. Hope you guys got something good from Santa this year. And I hope you guys got a lot of good presents on the tree that he gave y'all and left y'all. What he left for Commentator Vader was nothing but a bunch of rocks and coals that you use for a trip for the Polar Express train. <laughs> nah, I'll play with you guys. Um, he did, however, gave Vader uh, a new lightsaber and a new job working as a commentator with Alex, which is something that he did not want to do. I'll play. Um, but yeah, I enjoyed my holidays and stuff like that. It was it was fun. It was fun. I hope you guys enjoyed it too. I hope you guys enjoyed it too. But uh, yeah, so now we're about to go into this gameplay. And oh, and uh, speaking of gameplays, um, now I know I know I have been recently uploading videos to you guys like recently, like almost every day. Well, you know, I was just I was in a rush. Well, let me just explain. I was in a rush to get the Mario uh sport. More, the Sparta Sport Big Saga finish it well done. So, yeah, that's why I have I was keep on uploading you guys that kind of view because I didn't because I was in a rush to do like gameplays like this for instance. So I'm sorry I'm I'm not in a desperate mood to like get you guys to subscribe or like my channel or like my videos or whatever stuff like that. I'm just showing you guys what um I'm just trying to show you guys entertainment. You know I'm not showing you guys I'm not trying to tell you guys you know like my page be a subscriber so I can do like things like that. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not aiming for fame for fortune. Try move. I'm not aiming for fame or fortune for that. I'm just trying to show you guys entertainment. And besides, I noticed in like out of my other Mario Sport big videos that you guys, even though I don't get the likes, 
I got like a little bit of likes, I got a little bit of comment comments. You guys really do tune in to the video of Team Royalty. And that's one thing I appreciate. I, I really want to thank you guys for those who are watching Team Royalty gameplays and stuff like that. And a little bit of the Mario Brothers. <clears throat> but really it's all about Team Royalty. Because you know why? I'll tell you why you guys like it. You got the Princess Peach. But that also because of... Oh, shit. <laughs> I said her name and she fell right off the freaking road. Bro, right off the freaking road. It's not only because of Princess Peach, it's because of also Princess Daisy and how we just talk about their, uh, you know, about what they what they did in their past, present, and stuff like that. So, you know, that's, that's what it's really about. And also Toad's Revolution, where he decides to do something that Bowser freaking done he's trying that for the first time but uh yeah so shout out to princess shout out to team royalty they now starting to make uh oh my god they're now starting to make a great 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 impression on themselves so congratulations to team royalty very good thing very good thing i'm in second place now and now i'm in ninth place what the freak son come on dude this is not what i This stupid bonehead just did what I think he just did. No! If I would have flipped, I would have been on the road on target, man. Oh my god. Let me see what I can do. Let me see what I can do. Cut down. Okay, cut down to fifth. That's not bad. Ugh. I was a second though, so I was telling y'all. But yeah, so like I said, I want to show you guys some other videos, like on some other days. Like it's not gonna be videos being shown to you guys like almost every day. It's gonna be some videos. It's gonna be like video shows to you guys like I think three or two days a week, and and I think I think I'm gonna show you guys videos on the weekends. I don't know which video I'm gonna show you, but the Mario Sport Mix one, no, not the Mario. Um, the Mario Kart one, I can show that to you guys like on a Saturday or a Sunday. I think I can show you guys these kind of gameplays on a Saturday and stuff like that because this is like the latest game that I have, and I want to show you guys some other latest games that I got. And for Saturday and Sunday, I think I'm gonna do like uh, recent games and past games on the weekend. So I think that's gonna be cool. You know, I think that's gonna be cool for you guys. I think I hope you guys like it. But I just gotta pick out a day, so I think I I, I think I can I can decide on what day. I think I can decide decide on what day to like make a game play, to like make a heads up or you know setting out gameplays or something like that. Because literally I've been showing you guys random gameplays, but I'll give you guys a heads up on what day um I'm I'm getting ready to upload video. I'm uh, getting ready to upload a video because honestly it's just it's 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 not because it's like I said it's not because I don't want you guys to just randomly like my channel or give me thumbs up and give me views because I want to show you guys I want to entertain you guys like like I've already entertained you with commentator like I've already entertained people with commentator Vader and Alex because you know and you know they like to talk about the characters and what they did and what they did in the past and stuff like that you know just try to get to know you just try to let you get let you guys get to know me and get to know Vader and get to know commentator Alex but as of right now, the only thing that I do know is that in this race right now, I have to get a first place because this is tight. This is that last race that just, I don't know, that last race. No. Like I said, that last race right there just knocked me, just, just, I don't know. It just ended up knocking me off. So, oh, I gotta get in front of Link. I gotta get in front of Bowser. Uh, Bowser fell off. Bowser fell off. Oh, and someone killed my flower. Someone killed my flower. What the heck, man? Dang it. Get this, get this, get this. Yeah, have a banana. Yeah, that's take that, take that. <laughs>
did that. No. Somebody with their meat character did that. Oh, wow, I got that mushroom. I gotta get back. I gotta get out of seven. Oh, come on, dude. oh my god, this guy just bumped me off for no reason. Oh my god, that guy just bumped me off for no reason at all. Okay, you know what? Oh my god. Son, this is this is this is crucial man. This is freaking crucial. Do not hit me with that with that bullet. Please don't. Oh bad, huh? Oh, oh shoot! No! No! Oh come on, dude! Jeez man! Give me a double item. I want to get out of Ace. Give me a bullet, please. Give me a bullet. Run him over, run him over, run him over, run him over, run him over. Back in fifth. You know, I just noticed the bullet in this one is not as fast as the one in the Wii for some reason. I noticed that. It's really not. If you look at it, the bullet is like kind of slow. But yeah, anyways, Princess Peach for fifth once again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, so now I gotta pick another one. I'm gonna go with this one. I'm gonna go with uh, Rainbow Road 64 and this one. And uh, just to let you guys, and just to give you guys a heads up, for Christmas, uh, actually, no, not to give you guys a heads up. I'm sorry. Um, Just to tell you the truth, for Christmas, I got a, a, a Mario Monopoly game for Christmas. Yeah, a Mario Monopoly game. And. Throughout that whole entire time, me and the family was playing that game, and it was actually kind of cool. It's actually kind of fun because they say because they said when you play that game, they say that the game is actually like uh the game is actually like um it's like playing Mario Kart and Mario Party at the same time. Actually, it's like playing a Super Mario game slash Super Mario Kart and Super Mario Party. But to me, it's like. Mario Party and Mario Kart all mix into one board game, so yeah, it's like that. It's like you gotta, it's like you gotta roll the dice, take an item, take someone's money, and so on and so on. And in that game, there is no way for you to like, there is no way for you to like lose out. Like in regular Monopoly games, you play, like regular Monopoly games, you play them until like you're out of money, and then when you're out of money, you're out. You automatically lose until the last one is standing with a lot of money. That's, you know, basically the part of the whole Monopoly game. But in this one, in this one, Super Mario game, when you run out of money, you don't automatically lose, like, go oh, out. Wow, I don't know, I don't know if that's literal. I mean, like, you don't lose automatically once you, like, out of money. You still play to try to get money, and you, like, and once money, and once there's money, like, right there on the board, it's like there's a free park in every. Like seriously, once you drop the money in the board and someone go past it or someone land like you just take it. <laughs> wow, that's that's kinda cool though. But the game was kinda cool. It really is kinda cool though, if you just look at it that way. Alright, so I'm back oh, okay, I'm in first place like three times like supposed to be in. And I think I'm gonna change characters right after this. I'm gonna do another character for like three more turns and then after that I think I'm gonna no 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 Okay God For the first time for the first time ever I'm now in first place It took me a while to get in first place because like I've had so many issues I had so many issues with like you know these races right behind me like they keep coming after me, blowing me up. Oh my god. I know you did not just get rid of that green shell. For a god darn, for a god darn coin. Peach! 
You just got rid of your defense. Now how you use the to pass the finish line and protect it. You see what I mean? Now this guy right there, he's in first place. Okay, now you're back. Yo, who hit me with a freaking but Oh my god. Yo, you see? Oh my god. Peach for fourth, fifth again. You serious? That's the third freaking time she came in fifth. Oh my god. Are you freaking kidding me? She came in fifth place three freaking times. God, man. You're in first place and then what happened? Some dumb idiot... Oh my god. I hope you guys just saw the name on top of the second place, right? I'm gonna leave that alone. Um But yeah, Peach came in third place. Like, come on. Alright, I'm gonna change it up and I'm gonna go with Daisy on this one. I'm gonna go with Daisy on this one and I'm gonna go with this kind of card that she has. That's crazy. Princess Peach in first place. What happens? She ends up in free. That is so stupid. Come on, man. It's New Year's Eve. Give a guy a break. But, uh, yeah, anyways, uh, just to let you guys know, speaking of Princess Daisy, you know that Monopoly game I was talking about, tell you guys? Um, yeah, about that, I noticed something. Princess Daisy is not in Monopoly, and not in Monopoly. Well, you know what? It's actually kind of a good thing because let's just say this. Actually, no. It's kind of a. It's kind of a. To me, it's kind of a, a weird thing because you know what? Princess Daisy is like. I let me just say this. I'm a huge, huge Star Fox fan. Like, like I told you guys that from the beginning of my YouTube channel, and from that point, I've been. Then from that point, I started out playing Star Fox. And then after that, I started, and my second one was, uh, Sonic Riders. And the third Star Fox, and my second Star Fox game, play was complicated by Complicated Vader. But on top of that, I just want to let you guys know that out of the Super, out of Mario Yoshi, the be in my top three, my all-time favorite princess is always and forever going to be Princess Daisy. Why? Daisy. Why? I'll tell you why. Daisy is not like me. Okay, let's say she's not like Peach. She's not a damsel in distress that's ready to be rescued all the time. And for some reason, for some freaking reason, Rosalina is getting more attention from Nintendo than Daisy. I mean, like, let me just let me just let you guys be clear. Let me let me clear you out. Daisy has been a part of the Mario franchise since 1989. That's what Commentator Daisy said in the last. He said that before, right? Yeah, I think he did say that. Um, and the fact thing is, oh, oh, you try to get me with that shell, you miss. And the fact thing is, and the fact, oh my god, son, how did I freaking get hit by that boomerang? And the fact thing is, Princess Daisy has been in, in a lot of Mario, lot of Mario events, like. He ha she has been in a lot of Mario sport games. God. She has been in a lot of Mario sport games. She's been in a lot of Mario... She's been in a lot of Mario Party games. It's like, what, Mario Party 2 or 3? I think 2 is when she debuted or she did Wallowee. And she's also been... She's also been in a, move, a, a Super Mario movie. Yeah, she's also been in a Super Mario, Super Mario movie. The realistic one. The almost realistic one. That was made in 1993 yeah. stupid Mario freaking Mario um yeah she's been in that and on top of that she hasn't even been able to be in a smash bro like that's one thing I really want to see like, a smash bros game fourth place okay one of the people I want to see for the Daisy in a Smash Bros game because like when Melee came out 
She should have been in that one at least. But when Brawl came out, she wasn't in it. And fourth one came out. You know who was actually in it from the Mario friend from the Mario series? Princess Rosalina. Now, why is Princess Rosalina in it? I have no clue why she was in it. But it sounds like, but to me, it sounds like to me that Princess Rosalina is almost trying to be a second best, second best princess than Princess Daisy. And that's just, that's just weird. How can you make, like, like let me just say this, 2017 is almost about to end. Rosalina debuted it in Mario, in Mario, Super Mario Galaxy in 2007 for the Nintendo Wii. And 10 year, and from 10 year, and now it's her 10th anniversary from day in her debut. Seriously, if you look at it, she 2017 is about to end, or I think 2000, or I think next year will be her 10th anniversary here, or it will be her first 10 years here, or whatever. But yeah. Rosalita has been in the Mario franchise for 10 years, and she's been getting the kind of stuff that Daisy should have been getting. Like, for instance, Rosalina has been in a Smash Bros. game for the first time. Daisy has not. Rosalina has been in a Super Mario game. Daisy isn't in a Super Mario game. Rosalina has... De oh, my God. Rosalina debuted in a Mario Kart game. Daisy debuted in the one for the game. Yeah, the one for the game. That was awesome. And she deb and, and yeah, that, I think that's Daisy's first Mario Kart. Yeah, Ma Daisy's first Mario Kart was Mario Kart Double Dash. When they were both teamed up. And you know what, honestly? Princess to you know, um it seemed like to me that Princess Daisy was always a shadow to Princess Peach. And that is one thing I did not want to. I do not want Daisy to be a shadow of Princess Peach. I, I would like to see her, like you know, like like for, like for instance, Luigi. He's no longer Mario's shadow. He's now Luigi's now the man who got his own game. Yoshi got his own game. Peach got his own game. Toad got his own game. Mario got his own game. And on top of that, Daisy. It's not in none of those games. She's not even in, you know what, if Princess Daisy, I mean, if Princess Peach had another game, her own, another own game, I would bet money that Daisy would be in I mean, she already did for the Nintendo DS, so I'm just saying, like, to reference it, if she ever came out one for the Nintendo Switch, for instance, like, hypothetically, if she came out one for the, the Switch, my question is, who do you think will be there to help her out? Will you think it will be Princess Daisy or Princess Rosalina? My consideration would be, I can say it would be both, but I really want Princess Daisy to be a favorite character in a Super Princess Peach game that hopefully, hopefully will maybe in a year, in a nearby, in a far future come out. Oh, but um, but uh, yeah, and um, that's the thing, cause like you know, I. Um, like, Rosalina has been getting far much attention than Daisy has. I mean, she's in the Smash Bros. She even has her own piece in, um, Mono Super Mario Monopoly. I'm like, what the freak? How did Princess Rosalina get her own, her own, oh my god, sixth place, come on. Gets her own piece in Monopoly and Daisy's not. And it's like, they're not treating Daisy right. I mean, like, Daisy's by far the best princess in, Mario fr in the Mario franchise. I mean, like, if she get captured by Bowser, she can stand toe-to-toe -to -toe with Bowser, for instance. And besides that, people, and let me just say this. People will go, we're going to Baby Park. People will go crazy if Daisy was in Super Smash Bros. The new one that might, hopefully, will come up for the Switch. But if she was in that, do you w imagine the fights that she will be in? Princess Daisy versus Princess Peach versus Princess Rosalina versus Princess Zelda versus Su Zero Suit Summers versus Baronetta and other female characters that will be in that game. And but imagine this: Princess Daisy versus Bowser. That will be the most courageous fight ever. Princess Daisy versus Princess. 
I said Princess Daisy. Princess Daisy versus Bowser. That will be the most best fight ever. Seriously. Like just just imagine it. And you're playing and you're playing as Daisy. I mean like I know you play Peach and you have her in a Daisy costume. And you pretend like, oh that's I'm pretending like this is Princess Daisy versus Princess I mean versus Bowser. You know? But really, I mean like give Daisy some credit. She's been in the game for like longer than Rosalina and already Rosalina is skyrocketing second best to Princess Peach. Like that's not her place. Like no offense, Princess Daisy is second best to Peach. But overall, I can say that Daisy is like far way more better than Princess Rosalina and Princess Peach. Before And, and besides that, before Princess Peach, Rose, uh, Paulina was like... The one for Mario, but I know Daisy. Daisy's the woman for Luigi, so yeah. And speaking of Rosalina, we're about to prove to her right now that Daisy is by far the most second, is by far the most best princess in the Mario franchise. If this guy would get out of the face, yeah, I had I thought he got blown up. Okay, so. We're in fifth place. I want to go for first. I want to go for first. So let's try to see if we go for first. Let's hold that. Oh my god. I just lost a... To a stupid frog. God, I fell off. We got a star. We got a shell. I'm about to get hit. I got hit. I got hit. And the black Yoshi and Metal Mario. Yo, come on, seriously? It dodged me. <laughs> it dodged me. It went for someone else. Okay, so I took it a shortcut. I'm in fourth place. I don't want to be in fourth no more. I got hit, but I recovered. Alright. You know, I'm actually surprised that the blue shell in this one doesn't have wings. You know, because it flies above everyone who's... Ooh. It flies above everyone, and it just goes after the first place. Group. But you know what? They're doing exactly what 64 did. Just hit random people, and they get the first place group. And I actually kind of like that. I thought it was kind of cool. Because I was wondering why the blue shell doesn't hit no one when it flies above your head, but it goes out of the first place and it targets you and then it hits you. But then I realized, um, just to give you guys a heads up, which I'm pretty sure you people already know, to avoid the blue shell, you know, you have to have a that uh that loud sound surround sound box that will like when you have a blue shell above your head, you gotta have that thing. So when you hit it, the blue shell gets it off. Yeah, so that just wanna let you guys know about that. But um uh, yeah, so okay, so we got a third place with Daisy. Not bad. That's not bad. Okay, so I guess we're gonna have to call it quits here for today. So yeah. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna call it quits here for today. Oh, and just to let you know about what I said earlier, um I will be showing you guys uploaded videos. I'm not gonna be showing you guys like tomorrow Tuesday I think I'm gonna show you guys uploaded videos Wednesday and I think I'm gonna show you them Friday and as for Saturday and Sunday I think I'm gonna do Sunday and Saturday I think I'm gonna do old school games on Saturday and Sunday I think on one of those days but you know what I think I should go for one more gameplay you think I should go for one more gameplay y you know what okay I t okay yeah uh, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go with one more
I'm gonna go with one more gameplay because I want to show you guys. I wanna, I wanna end Daisy on a good note for this year. Okay, so I'm gonna go with one more gameplay. Then after that, I'm definitely going to leave. Cause <laughs> I gotta get ready for New Year's. You know, I'm gonna be playing a game. I'm gonna be playing. I'm gonna be playing Star Fox right after this. But no, that, I'm not gonna be show you guys. I'm gonna be. I'm, not, I'm just gonna play the Star Fox game in general, like by myself. So. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Come on, Lando Baby Park. Yes! Alright, Baby Park it is. Let's go! For 2017, let's go. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Okay. Oh, get out of my way! What the freak? Is that gold one? Yeah, it is. He's an unlockable character in the game, isn't he? Come on, why do I want to pick an item? Come on, get out of my way. I'm like, dog, all I've been doing is getting mushrooms, man. I'm not even getting no shells or anything. I'm stuck in fifth. I should have ended when I was in third. Oh my god, and I just ran into a bomb. <laughs> I just ran into it. Like, I just ran in straight into it. Now I'm in seventh place because of that. Come on, man, what the freak? Come on, Daisy. Come on, we're stronger than this. Oh my god. Okay, we ended the gameplay in 8th. Okay, you know, I'm going to end this gameplay in 8th place. I should have ended it while I was in 3rd place, man. What the freak? Son, man. I hate racing in 100 and 100. And, I hate I hate racing in 100. Okay. Anyways, I'm going to end the gameplay here, ladies and gentlemen. So like I said, um, Monday, uh, uh, not Monday. Wednesday and Friday will be new gameplays of whatever game I'm continuing from. I think it will be Crash Game another day will be something else saturday and sunday i still gotta think about gameplay of which one to pick so yeah so anyways guys thank you for watching this is star fox just say happy new year i'll see you guys in 2018 please remember to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you didn't like the part where princess peachy daisy got a fifth second but at least princess daisy got a third so that's one thing anyways i gotta uh i gotta jet out of here this is Starfire. This is Starfire. Get say thank you for watching. Please remember to leave comments below and give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. And when I mean and when I mean subscribe, I'm just saying that literally. I'm not saying that like you know, just like I'm saying. I'm not saying please subscribe to my channel. Please, I'm not saying that. I'm not being desperate or anything. I'm just saying you know, it's up to you. If you're subscribing to Starfire Jet, you enjoy watching my channel. Anyways, Starfire Jet say. So far, Jay, stay sorry, sorry to Jeff, but I will see you guys in 2018. Sayonara, people.